So here's the setup for testing the PMG. So I've got the source of energy, that's the LPG gas. Uh, then I got the petrol engine. And then that spins the flywheel. Uh, and then there's a reduction in the velocity ratio. So that now from the flywheel, we spin the PMG. And then from the PMG down here, uh, I've got this meter set to the current, measuring AC current. It's in series with the load. So I've, I've chosen to use this electric kettle because it provides a resistive load that is constant, uh, unlike other appliances. So we are going to get a... Um, uh, constant load across the PMG. Um, so this meter is going to measure the AC voltage down here and uh, frequency in hertz up there. So the good thing about the hertz is that um, the hertz correspond with the spinning velocity uh, or the, the RPM for the, for the PMG. So even if you are going to get voltage sags, we are going to confirm that the PMG did not slow down uh, by looking at the hertz because that, that's not going to change if the speed of the rotation of the PMG is constant. So the flywheel is going to make sure that the, the speed of rotation is constant because it's going to store a lot of energy and it's able to release that energy uh, when we do the test. <coughs> so I've got these uh, double pole here. And that is the one that is going to connect to the kettle. So I'm going to switch the kettle on. So that means when I flip this switch, uh, the kettle is going to start drawing power from the from the PMG. And then we are going to see the, the result. So I'm going to get this spinning. I'm going to go up to 240 volts AC. And then because that's what the PMG is rated for, uh, as you can see here, it's rated for 240 volts. So I'm going to spin it until I get to 140 volts and then you're going to connect the load and then we'll see what happens. I got the PMG running and generating 240 volts. Uh, as you can see, everything is spinning fine. Got the petrol engine spinning the flywheel, which spins the PMG. And as you can see, the current is zero. Uh, the volt output voltage is 242 volts and we've got 38 hertz uh, and that's the load so uh, I switched it on and then I flipped the the double pole to on and as you can see there's a very big uh, voltage sag uh, the voltage got down to 66 volts and um, we only got 2.91 amperes and as you can see, the frequency is now at 36 hertz, down from 38. So that's um, minimal fluctuation uh, in hertz. Uh, so that means the PMG did not slow down considerably, uh, but the voltage did drop considerably. That comes to 65 times 3, which is 125 watts uh, across that single phase. I increased the speed of the petrol engine to the maximum and as you can see I could get up to 74 volts and around uh, 3.2 amperes for a total of about 236 watts. Uh, so what I'm going to do next is um, I try to spin the PMG uh, at a higher speed more than probably the higher RPM. But before I do that, um, I need to open up the PMG to see the internal structure to make sure that it will be able to with really start uh, running at those higher RPMs. The PMG is rated for 30 kilowatts, uh, which means I should be able to get 10 kilowatts across um, this one phase. Uh, when I get to 240 volts, that is if it's up to spec, which which I really doubt. But I'm going to give it the benefit of the doubt. And um, if 
provide a mechanism to get it to output 240 volts at the load and then i will see how much power you are going to be getting out of this single phase so in the next video i'm going to open up the pmg so that we can see the internal internal construction uh, so that i can try and assess and make sure that it will be able to spin at those high rpms because i'm going to spin it at higher than um, 300 rpms because that's what it was rated for but uh, i think it's apparent that maybe it might need to spin at higher rpms for us to get to the desired uh, wattage output uh, i will also look at the temperature because there is no active cooling uh, implemented on this pmg but maybe there is you'll see when we open up the, the insides so watch out for the next video where i'm going to um, open up the pmg and then there'll be other videos following to try and see whether we can get more power out of it uh, so please uh, like and subscribe uh, so that you can get notified when i upload those other videos